Hey, thanks so much for joining us. I'm Patrick McKee. There are more cases of coronavirus in Virginia. Nine people have now presumptively tested positive. Governor Northam spoke this morning about the Commonwealth's response to the crisis. 10 News reporter Taj Simmons joins us now in the studio with what the governor said. Taj, big thing everybody wants to know, are there any cases locally right now? Not yet. As mentioned, there are nine cases. That was more than there were earlier in earlier press conferences, but these cases are becoming more widespread, and that means areas as well. That's why Governor Northam and Virginia's top health officials are telling people to continue taking precautions against the coronavirus. As mentioned, there are now nine presumptive cases of coronavirus. Most are in northern Virginia, with a case each in the Virginia Beach area and in Hanover County, that's near Richmond. Health officials have said they now have the capacity to test up to 600 patients for coronavirus. Governor Northam said the coronavirus is not widespread enough in Virginia yet to call a state of emergency, but he is prepared to do so if the situation gets worse. It is up to all of us to step up to help keep ourselves and each other safe. We all, we all as Virginians have a responsibility, and I appreciate everybody taking this seriously. Governor Northam added he has told lawmakers to save room in this year's budget, which they are voting on tomorrow for coronavirus response funding, and also talked with the Department of Insurance on how to lower costs for COVID-19 tests. In addition, Senator Tim Kaine discussed what is being done at the federal level to fight coronavirus. I'll tell you what he had to say on 10 News Tonight. Reporting live, Taj Simmons, 10 News, working for you.